Hi, I'm back and with some more State of K2 and with another episode for The Whisperers. We're on episode 189 of the Let's Play series and continuing on as always. And yeah, back with some more. We've been alternating between this and... Um, uh, gas Station Simulator the past few days. Um, and we've got kind of this little section. Um, so we got... Uh, the next, I think, yeah, we've got one more State Decay on the channel after this one, and then two gas station coming up, um, and then after that we'll have a little bit of a break, we'll see if they use maybe 60 seconds, I don't really know yet, I'll do, I'll do something, it might not be a long time, but just a little bit of a period to have a break because it's been a bit of the same for a bit um nothing like a big series or anything um and then we'll continue with this a bit more after um because yeah i think at the minute state of k and gas station simulator especially gas station um like today it's a bit annoying um uh gas station simulator was put on sale it not a big sale though. Like, it, um, I don't think it was the hand. version I bought. I bought the DLC version. Um, with I can't remember the DLC's name. Uh, pretty much the customization one. Um, so I pretty much got that. Um, and then I got. But today I had an impulse buy because the one thing I didn't get in the bundle, which I probably should have, and it's kind of stupid because I've probably spent more now technically. Um, but I noticed that they put uh, the um, air hangar um, aircraft DLC um, on sale. It's only like ten percent off, so it's only like sixty p down um but i thought fuck it i should have it and then we've got uh, even more content to get through in gas station um even though like the get uh, the aircraft simulator like that that bit looks a bit crazy um but yeah um i'm kind of in that mindset now of um Giving gas station. Oh, I've got, I've, got, I've just got more to do in gas station. That's all now. Um, I've, I've definitely spent more on it than I probably should. Because it's weird. The pricing in that game is really manipulative. Because they've got like, it's they've got bundles with the DLCs, right? But the thing is, the DLCs are in the game anyway. Whether you have it or not, um, because um, when I went to install it, it says it's already. In, you don't need to download it. Like a lot of other games, like you always have to download the DLC. But the with the simulator, it's all in it, so you just pay to unlock the feature. So it's more like skins, if anything. I, I know it's weird. It's just still it doesn't matter, but like. Technically, buying gas station, you've got it downloaded anyway. It's just you paying to unlock it. Like, it is what it is, I suppose, yeah. But, like, maybe the game could be a lot lighter, like, smaller. Um, but I think COD does that. I might be wrong. Terrific. But, yeah. It's a bit annoying, I think. Uh, what are we doing? Should we go talk to way. the Shouldn't cannibals? Um, yeah, I'm I'm planning on doing some playing some Sea of Thieves tomorrow because I've got a day off. Um, because my we're actually going to sit me and my mates who ain't been able to play games together properly. Ever because they're on PlayStation, 
them on Xbox. Um, but they got Sea of Thieves, so first time in ever we're, we're going to be able to play it tomorrow. So I don't know if I'm going to stream it. Um, I might just chill and uh, kind of get back into Sea of Thieves, but I might stream it a little bit, maybe. Um, that's why I think I will do some Sea of Thieves, whether it's with my mates or not. So I think I want to do a little bit. Alright, let's go see the cannibals. It's good to be back in State of Key, as always. I, uh, I am kind of thinking that it would be nice to find something new as well. Um, I think what I'll do is probably when we are close to wrapping up and moving maps, I'll probably have a break then. At this point. Um, at the minute, I'm happy sticking with it. Because there's still bits for us to do on here. We need some new people. Keep an eye out, will ya? I know someone who might be interested. Let me go find out. Some more food. Mean. It would have been kind of funny if we could have took someone from another enclave, like an allied. Yeah. Bloody boat. I saw this coming. Without enough storage, we lost the I need to start crafting some stuff, because I'm... I'm not getting anything for, like, especially the food that we've got craft coming in. I'm not getting anything for it. It's just a waste. If the person I'm thinking of is still here, I bet they'd be interested. Make sure you both come back in one piece. Is anyone in here? Oh, that's a lot. Good news. I have your new recruit right here with me. You have a good thing going here. I respect that, I do. Where's that blow come out? Blow's come out, no way. Double beautiful. Dad's carrying a plague. Don't let it hit you. This is my boy of checking. Cover me. I hate when they run. I don't know why. That was impressive. I don't remember them being like that. I don't know. I swear when the game came out, it weren't like that. 
They are really. I, I suppose it's good that they're a bit more aggressive, but I don't know. The animation looks a bit weird, and it's just annoying. It's really hard to read. Not too bad. I don't know why. It's like in State of Cave One, like zombies were really good and easy to read and learn. This will be your new home. Um. Infestation. So close to the base. What's going on? Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on? What's that about? I swear on the mini map it looked like an uh, infestation. What? I don't think I've got any play cards open. Look, the icon looks like it's a play card. Um, infestation. Weird. Hmm. It's an interesting one. I know I was probably talking about something and I blanked it. We either need to build more storage, use up some supplies, or watch the excess walk away. Where you stop talking. That's heavy. Why have I got... I don't know why I've got really bad carrying capacity. But I'm really tempted to get um, a Series X though. I'm really close to getting one because um, I was checking earlier on uh, Amazon and I can get a Series X for like 400 quid. And I was looking at other bundles and stuff to see if there's any games that I could might be interested. But honestly, um, most of it's like Forza. I've got Game Pass anyway, so Forza Horizon 5 is Game Pass. Um, I think the other one was like Diablo. Um, I think the only bundle that I would be really interested in would be Starfield or um, uh, Dead Space. But that's what I mean. I'm really, really tempted. Because like, I've been going on about it. I, I think I need to treat myself or something. Um, and I don't know if it's going to make much difference. Because I don't really have a TV to support. 4K or anything like that, but surely it doesn't matter. Like I suppose at the end of the day, it's more about like power to have, be able to play. But the thing is, there's a lot of games that I'm not really like. Wow, well, I I need this. I need an next gen console because at the minute I'm on an Xbox One. 
the original black, big, bulky, no power really. But it's done me. It's done me since I got. I I had to, and I still have to. Um, but one of them, the disc tray got broke. So essentially, I've got a, dis <laughs> a uh, digital only Xbox One and a uh, full power well, disc. Please, Xbox One, in. which I use down here. Um, Listen, you be safe out there. Listen. But yeah, so I, I don't know. I'm kind of tempted to keep both Xbox Ones, but I'm kind of tempted to maybe look into a cheap monitor or cheap 4K TV, like a monitor size. Set it up like a PC setup. I know that's really sad. A really fucking sad. But it might be just kind of the setup I need for like streaming and doing videos. Because then I'm a bit more closer to the stream. Which is probably bad for me, but... Because you know how many games I'm playing and I'm like... Really struggling to read a bit of text or something. Because I'm on my sofa, chilling. Which I would miss. I would have to get like a proper chair and everything. But... I don't know. I'm thinking about it. Um. Whoa, they've come out of bounds. Oh, right, they're blind, they're blind, so they can't see me. Just hearing. Time to be a whisperer. Why are they locked on? They shouldn't be able to see me. They're blind. I could play something like uh, Dead Space, which I would love to play. The remake or remaster. Like, I really want to play that. Um, or, um, what was it? Like, I would love to give um, Starfield a go. I don't know if I would like it. Because it's not really like Mass Effect or anything. But at the end of the day, like I said, there's not really a lot of games on next gen that I'm like, I need no to play it. I'm pl playing Red Dead at the minute, and sure, it's Xbox One, so not the best version, but man, when a game like Red Dead still looks good on a Series X, no, Xbox One, then it just shows that other games, they're just not really standing out like others like like Red Dead. When when something like Red Dead is like making Xbox One look good. And then you play games like <laughs> in a way this or Fallout or something where they're not best looking games but they run like dog dirt. I think this is a bit more like hang on, why is this running so bad? But why am I crashing? Why am I crashing so much in this? Oh, 
Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I love that. I love that. Yeah. Yeah, I think... We've not had like a next gen game in a long, long time. I found they managed to get bread that on it last gen. Well, wow. Xbox One is incredible. Yeah. When you look at it. They they did really work wonders with that game. Sure, to its credit, not a lot goes on in it. But I don't know. There's so many devils that always complain about memory or something. That kinda of holds them back. But then, whatever Rockstar's using really doesn't struggle with it at all. Because, like, we've been pl we've, I've been playing a bit, honestly, Xbox, uh, Red Dead now through our plays playthrough. And we've not crashed once. There's not been, like, a stutter or a lag or a... Like, a, like a, just, just something that you would expect from a game like that. Like, like state decay. If you're driving into certain areas of the map, like you, sometimes you get a black screen. Like the last episode on the channel, we crashed because of one of them, uh, or it was the episode before. Um, and yeah, it's fine. Like, I, like if the game I love, like state decay, I'm a bit more I'll leeway. See all I can it. see. But I think a lot of people. State of case quality isn't the best. Like, it just isn't. And hopefully they improve on State of K3, which I, I'm sure they're gonna try and get. We've got a bit more support from all the other de all the other studios Xbox has now, so it is good at the end of the day. But, um, but yeah. State Decay 1 into this. The quality has never been brilliant when it comes to light stuff, which is fine because it is an indie game. I think a lot of people mistake like this or double A. I suppose State Decay 2 is more double A than triple A. But even then, triple A games, they're most of the point time bollocks. Half the triple A games coming out now, they're just fucking. They're disgusting how they release some of these games and they expect to have the title of AAA or why well, they don't even deserve the title of indie. Because indie developers they have a bit more self respect for the, what they're trying to create. But like yeah, like, like they, a lot of devs they're just they're like it's big studios anyway, they just mug people off. And that's where like, a lot of this, like, Microsoft Studios, they are doing alright. Some of them are slipped, and maybe they're not the best support or coverage or things like that, but like, something like State of Game or Sea of Thieves, they've got good teams buying them. When you see it, because they want to make something good for the community, and somehow they're able, they've been able to, like State Decay. It's not, it shouldn't really have had its sixth birth, birth, birthday, and have been celebrated like it has been. Okay, nothing more to see here. 
because a lot of games they would have just moved on, but it is incredible we've had the support we have had for State of Decay. And then you look at Sea of Thieves. It's good with Sea of Thieves as well. Um, it's like it's kind of funny. Like you have something like St Microsoft, or at least they support the games hey, pretty well. I have a proposal for you. Let's meet. Because then you have like something like EA, where um, you have something like EA, where like Anthem died, and it could have had something with Anthem, I think. I think there could have been something with Anthem. Easy. But. I don't know. It's the same with 2042 in a way, I suppose. But, yeah, that, I don't know. There's a, there's a fine line with certain things. Because I think Anthem could have been cool if they weren't just. I, I think it's because a lot of the time they're bullshit. I can't carry that. When you stop bullshitting about your game, then you've got problems. Or, and that's why I think the trailer for State of K3 is a bit bullshit. And not needed. I think it would have been a lot better if they just did like a title card. And that would be it. Um, they say, oh, State of K3 is coming. But no, they do a massive CG cinematic trailer which is cool but at the end of the day it's not a lot it's not really what we're going to be playing because what I've heard like um, that trailer they did for State of K3 a lot of the devs weren't even at that stage of development it was just an idea so they probably gave the info well gave the idea to Microsoft for what they want to try and do with the next game Bullshitting probably, and that's what that's how they made the trailer. So whether we get an ounce of that, because like you look at State of K 2s trailer, like State of K 2s trailer, there's a lot, there's elements of that you see in the trailer that is um, what we get, but like character models have beards and stuff. Um, and that's weird. It's like, where did all that go? Well, like, that's the thing. Why can't Stay the Gay have bits, like facial feet, facial hair, and have that difference? Like, I know a lot of people say, like, why don't we have larger player model characters, like fat people? Um, which, to be fair, I don't know. If you've got a fat person in your community, they should probably get. You should probably get rid. But that sort of stuff, you know. Um, I think there is a lot of details in the State of K2 trailer where it's like, hang on, where is that? Like, I think, I don't know, I suppose Provident Ridge is that map now. But I swear, like, in one of the scenes, it's like a wooded, foresty area. And it kind of is Providence Ridge-like. So, yeah, I don't know about that. Come on, dickhead. Ooh. Oh. Fuck it. Supplies have been delivered. Can we do some crafting? I think it's needed. You know, I might as well fuel up. Company, but this is getting ridiculous. We need to expand. 
No, we don't. Let me can next one. Right, so let's see what we got. We've got food for days. Base. Uh, we've got f 68 food, 66 meds. Um, ammo. You can build some C thor C C C C four. You have put there. C four. C four. No. In chemical. Which fuel we got? Do like a Molotov me. Uh, my yeah, then I use the chemicals. No more room. That's what she said. No room for that. Look, we're just crafting. No room for that. Don't need to start talking. I have all I can carry. Yeah, I've got to be careful with the ammo. It's good to have a place where I fit in. Yeah, you don't realize how slow that was trying to interact with each Molotov then. We lost some resources. Meds. We can, yeah, we can get a load. Ooh. Can you keep him busy? Man, I barely ever use that. Things are working out. I feel good. I just dropped off some decent scraps at base. No more room. I'd have to drop something else first. No more room. No room for that. There we go. Wow, food. No more room. No room for that. That's why I always go for like that. That is so much. I, I, I don't know. I suppose that does give you a little bit of health, but I, I should use my no good stuff a bit more. I have all I can carry.
No more room. I can't carry that. I can't carry that. There we go. They shouldn't complain now. Uh, we're wasting stuff. We should start crafting stuff now. It'd be kind of good to see how the upgrade does. So yeah, we got some good stuff there. That's a good, good, good setup. Um, who we shall we play out? Who shall we play as? Oh yeah, I wanted to help them last time, but I didn't. I'm on my way. Shouldn't be too long. Thanks. <laughs> Shall we try them snacks? I never really use them. Oh, actually, I don't know why she's got such good items, but. How many we got? We got 100. So what does it do? Loaded with vitamins, calories and preservatives. Restores stamina immediately. Uh, restores little health and also briefly revives starvation. Hmm. Okay, we'll give that a go. The problem is that it'd be not like the reason why I always go for these is because when I put like two in my inventory, because I barely use my stun stims unless I'm desperate. Um, the reason why I use like these snacks is because, and the same with bandages, they're more common to come, common to come across. So say I've only got one in my inventory or two. The chances are I'll probably only find one in the open world. I don't know how good is how true that is. But the chances are I'll only find two in the open world. Um Um I might only find one in the open world or two. So it just stack easier into one spot. Whereas, when I carry something like this, the chance of finding something like this is kind of low. Even though it's really good. And I know, at the end of the day, a lot of people would probably just not bother picking something like that up. But I'm not sure. People should let me know. What is, their, what, what is your go-to stim? Like, stimulant? and med supply and throwable and my throwable is always the molotov i feel like that's a bit more accurate i know it feels a bit weaker lately so i don't know if they end up nerfing it but i always i always go for the molotov i don't know why but there's something i've always just picked no parties while i'm gone you hear Nasty group of zombies. It's actually nice today because um, I'm recording this after work, so it's late at night. So no blinding sun on my TV where I can't see.
This is when state when it, the best time to play state decay is pit in the night with all your lights off. Can't beat it. Those monsters will keep being a threat to us until we take them out. All of them. Good to hear. Lead on. I actually got some good supplies. You have more materials. Those monsters will keep being a threat to us until we take them out. All of them. I can't trade for some reason. Yeah, I've got some pipe bombers. Let's go blow them up. Why are they all the way down there? That's stupid. I've got my AK, so I can just shoot. Whoa! Close. That horde's coming in fast. Is it me or are these roads really big? The, the width of that road looks a bit weird. What does that mean? And the pathways. I wish I knew how to feel about this. Cesspit zombies. Oh, do they have like a uh, lotus stink to them? Stinky zombies. I do like the curveball. Like, I'm not a big fan of the black plague arts. I think that's like that's fine if you want the extra challenge, but I'd rather just have like the mutations for the zombies or Maybe like a trading thing, or I don't know. I like where it actually fixes zombies. That's what I'm kind of into. Black plague arts. Like I don't know. If you're into a challenge, then I get it. But I, for in, I think it's more of a nuisance than actually something. That I'm like, yeah, that's cool. Whereas like the zombie effects, I'm like, yeah, that's actually really cool. Because instead of actually having them having to make brand new zombie like types, here. it's time for you to die. Oh, I'm dead. Zombies headed this way. How do you fucking deal with them? Better make these shots count. Catch you in a bit. I'll tell you that.
To be fair, that rifle is better than what he freaking get me. Alright, if I want more space. Clever. <laughs> um I got maybe I'll drop this stuff off and maybe we'll loot up down here. That might I be a thing to do. Find anything good in here. Oh yeah, this is always a good secret spot. Found something. Yeah, look at that. Banging. This is always a good spot. It doesn't appear on the map. Yeah, shit tons. Hey, I suppose it could be worse. There we go, Pusscat. because if this stuff is actually decent this sort of stuff I don't need <laughs> fucking controls I'm trying to crouch is such a joke there you go no Fuel, man. Do you love a bit of fuel? Yeah, I'm gonna lose my phone in a minute. I'm gonna die, so I don't think I'm gonna get any. I'm not gonna get any info on how the stream's doing. Look at that crossbow. That's a lot of stuff. Why are they moving? Oh, they're gonna attack me. I don't know. I suppose I know I wanna. I said I wanted to loot that, but maybe go finish these guys off. I suppose if they wanted more food or something. Oh. I suppose I could take more food from them. See, like if I had like um, the other snacks, that would have stacked into that. Lovely. No more of that. Be beautiful. Yeah, let's head back. I would have milked it a little bit longer, but maybe we would go talk to these guys and then Let's see. They might end up attacking us. I don't actually know what the outcome is to these guys, or they're just actually just going to leave. I'll drop this stuff off first. So if I can trade with them, I might just take all the food and snacks. This is just a little bit more in it. This whole point of this, like, like pretty much this map rotation in the last was the whole point to like stop pile up. 
and then realistic nightmare and lethal I can kind of just utilize it all I'm still gonna be cheap though that's the thing <laughs> We hit the 50 minute mark now, so I need to keep an eye on the party, so I might get kicked. Or I might have a bit of an audio stutter. This thing, I'm not checking properly. Like, even if I've got my uh, Twitch on, I'm not really checking like I should be. This thing is fun to drive. Great for Providence Ridge. I have to finish off that one. Awkward, so I'm gonna level with you. We're gonna eat you and all your friends. Ah! You people are horrible, just horrible. Stay alive. Whoa, she got her shirt. If you don't pay, you die. Think of this again. Shame. Waste of a life. See what they've got first. I've got well, I've, 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 I've got space for all of it. Nice Make sure we see the good stuff. Oh, hang on. The house might be actually bad to loot. Oh yeah, look at that. Weapon parts. Uh. Maybe I should break down some of my more weapons when I get back. I ain't really had a proper look at my what I've got in my inventory. <laughs> yeah, I might come back. This is quite uh, a load rooks I'm carrying. Rooksacks are good. My rooksacks are always good trading items. Should I have a screwdriver? Yeah. So, 
If I put the screwdriver there, I should be able to stack it. Maybe, maybe we can leave a bit more. Maybe I equip that. Let me dump that in. Ha 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 ha. I'm smart. I will see what other stuff we've got in here first. There might be better loot. In general, all of it might be better. Instead of carrying knives and stuff. Wonderful. That's the thing. In Steady Kid, there's nothing really not useful. You do get stuff for everything. I think the only problem is, I think they need to look at the at trading or moving. the crafting. Because I, I, think, I think I checked when I did the. Th when we were trying to do a bit more effort in trading. Whenever we try to craft something, here. like um, silences or something, the trading value isn't as good as like what you would craft the item for. So like the economy in State of Decay is not really that intelligent or Sorry, can't carry worth that. the kind of effort, you could say. Like, For the most part, like it, it, it isn't worth it. I do like I do like the hyper auditory zombies. <laughs> I think they are good. The only thing is I don't like is I don't know why they like l are locking off the zombies to a certain area. Zombies drink stamina. <coughs> Zombies give influence. Like, is that them? Yeah, like there. Like, them zombies, they give influence. So they are pretty good to farm. But they're all the way up here. And for me, that's kind of like... I, I don't really want to deal with that, honestly. I'd rather just have them everywhere. When it comes to, like, the zombies that are changing and... All that stuff, like... I'm just saying, when, when we are using, um, I'm just saying, when we are using, uh, a firecracker, it's usually within a per, within, within the purpose of stealth. But then just before you throw it, she's going to say, fire in the hole. I've searched through everything here. There we go. Yeah. Relatively decent. Enough. I'm a little full at the moment. That's not going to fit. <laughs> I'm not going to say it. I always say it, and it's not appropriate. Right, let's go. There is bits I could collect. Oh, hang on. Party. I'm back.
likely to be killed by a human as a zombie. If you find yourself down in the two-way rifle range, don't hesitate. Zombies don't shoot back, but people do. Um, yeah, we'll call it there today. Got bits done. Um, I'm thinking maybe I will head up here. Uh, there's a little bit here to clear out. To be fair, yeah, there's a little bit down here to clean up. Um, yeah. Maybe I'll focus on this region and then really a few episodes after we'll try and focus on this upper corner. Because really we've got three plague arts left. That's pretty much the goal. And then really once we got them done, we'll be moving on to... Well, I don't know where we're going to move to for Nightmare. Um... Yeah, I'm not really sure. Uh, but yeah, this series is this part. Well, this part of the state of Gaze series is massive. But it is kind of a forever community anyway. I, I kind of wish I made separate playlists because technically there is like sub series. So, like, say someone wants to watch the Providence Ridge bit, this then I should have probably put it in its own little playlist um, and then the same with like when we did standard um, maybe I should have done it a little bit better with like Trumbull and then what would we do next but I don't know I, I, I have got different thumbnails so there is a little bit of a tell say where we're at to play through um, but yeah, but really, probably when I've just probably probably what I'll do is like I did with Trumbull Valley just before we move, or when I kill the last play guard, that's when we'll finish. Um, and I'll probably move on to another game or something, and then I'll when when we come back, we'll be moving. That's pretty much what it'll be. Um, but yeah, I'll leave it there today. We'll be back with some more State of K2 in the next few days. Um, so we've got Gas Station Simulator, not tomorrow, but the day after. We've got a bit that's already, already gone up. Um, yeah, enjoying that playthrough. So I highly recommend people check that out. Quite a chill thing. Uh, quite fun as well. Um, and then I've got the Airstrip DLC. So we'll... Um, be seeing how that goes uh, and then we've got State of K no, Red Dead um, Fallout going up from my main let's plays um, yeah at the end of the day we've got some good stuff on the channel uh, I'm going to try and keep it up um, and then in a little while we'll have a little bit of a break from this in gas station and do a few see if they use or something, I don't know we'll see what I want to do um and then, or if not, we'll be sticking with this kind of uh, gas station and stay the game. But, um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Um, but, yeah, as always, thanks for watching if you've been watching. And I'll see you all in the next one.